Hi everyone! Welcome to Tokyo Kitchen Japanese Cooking Club. I'm Yoshimi. Today, I'm going to show you how to make miso clam chowder. This is fake miso soup and clam chowder put together. Very comforting and filling soup and super easy to make. At the end of the video, I will show you how I build a menu with this miso clam chowder, so stay with me till the end. Okay, let's get started. These are what you need to make four servings. 200 grams of asali clam. I'm using frozen one, but you can of course use fresh one or other type of clams. Two teaspoons of hondashi, instant Japanese soup stock. Four tablespoons of miso paste. Two potatoes, one onion, one carrot, and two cups of milk. Let's peel and dice all the vegetables. Carrot. Cut the top and the bottom off. Make slices into sticks. All into the pot. Potatoes. Peel the skin. Remove the eyes if there is any. Into slices. Into sticks. And dice. Into the pot. Same for the other one. And onion. Cut the top and the bottom off. Peel the skin. Cut into half. Make slices this way. Then this way. Also into the pot. Two teaspoons of hondashi and two cups of water. 
Cover with the lid and let it simmer for 10 to 15 minutes. Try not to boil it. If you boil it, potatoes will hit each other in the pot and they break down into little pieces. Once the vegetables are well cooked, add clumps and cook for another 2 to 3 minutes. Okay, let's add milk. Give it a stir. And just heat it up until right before boiling. Try not to boil it. Okay. It's time to add the miso paste. I'm using this miso strainer to dissolve the miso. If you don't have this kind of miso strainer, you can use small tea strainer or small spider or ladle with holes. Put the miso in the strainer, dunk it and push it out. All dissolved. By using this kind of strainer, you don't have to worry about having chunk of miso in your soup bowl. Let's kill the heat and it's done. Serve in the soup bowl. And miso clam chowder is ready to go. Time for the tasting. Itadakimasu. Umami of the asali crumbs is infused in the milky soup and it's so good. If you want to make it richer, you can add some bacon when you cook the vegetables. This is how standard Japanese combo style meal looks. Rice, soup, main, one or two side dishes. Miso clam chowder goes here. How about teriyaki chicken panini, which will also cover the main? There are enough vegetables in the soup, so let's pass one of the side dishes and some sort of pickles for the other one to refresh your palate. I hope you enjoy the meal. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. More videos coming up on every Monday, Wednesday and Friday, so don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification bell on so that you don't miss anything. Bye!